just when you think you've seen it all before, you read about someone who's got a parking fine because their car's shadow, ostensibly, is in a disabled spot without authorization. Credit to the Mirror for reporting on this and to Mr. Cole for sending him the photograph. It very much looks to me like the car is not in the disabled space. As you can see from this shot here, you can see the line on the floor is clearly in front of the vehicle and only the vehicle shadow is in the disabled spot. Now, Lewisham Council says that Mr. Cole's appeal was rejected initially because he didn't provide reasoning why he objected to the parking ticket. But now the council says because he has now outlined his reasons for challenging the fine, they are looking into it in line with the legal process and will let him know the outcome in due course. Now, the legal point on this is that if the appeal fails, the person has 28 days within which to pay the penalty. Otherwise, they'll receive what's known as a charge certificate. And if they fail to pay this charge certificate within 14 days, they will get a court order demanding payment. And if someone gets such a court order, they have 21 days within which to pay the penalty charge notice or challenge the court order that demands payment, which is also known as an order of recovery. Now, whilst I can't see the entire road from this photograph, I can certainly see that the disabled spot seems to be outlined and the car is certainly not within it. The shadow, granted, is within the parking spot, but I didn't think that counts when it comes to parking charge notices. Anyway, I thought you'd find that interesting, so thank you for watching.